What is up, boys? Mitch Kaplan are doing some supports in gameplay, trying to invade their top side here, actually. But with support singed, you are going to be most likely playing versus melee supports, in which he is somewhat okay against. But in this game, I'm playing versus a enchanter support, which is actually not ideal. Singed wants to play versus melees if possible. Oh, does he have vision here? I want to try and kill this guy. I wanted to try and kill this guy. I think he'll go for red start, then we just murder him. We want, we want to cheese this, I think. He's going to walk around. I have Q and Ignite. Oh, he's done. Oh, he's done. Goodbye. <laughs> easy money, easy assist. Let's go. <laughs> I'm going to proc my Targons here in mid as well, running through. That way I can... Uh, actually... No, no, no. It's not even charged up yet. I'll just wait. Run run bottom. Help my brand. But yeah, you, you, you're you usually going to be roaming on support Singe. Uh, if you're versus an Enchanter, if you're versus a melee support, where they try and kill you in lane, Singe is a very good, like, counter-engage support versus melee champions. But he's not as good as a normal support, let's be real. So what you're really going to want to do is try and get your roaming going. Roaming is the way they want to play this character. If you are playing a Singe support game, you have access to items like Shirelias and Trailblazer, which I will be using this game. Uh, Brand needs to stop pushing that wave if possible. And let them shove into us. That way we can farm nearer to our turret and not get poked out. And I think you already pushed the wave, unfortunately, though, because it's pushing towards them. I, I might just have to perma roam and leave this guy. I'm not entirely sure. But I think he messed up the wave state. An ally has been slain. An enemy has been slain. You're pushing it towards them. I, <laughs> I told him to stop hitting the wave. You're pushing it towards them, bro. Chill. Just, just, just let them push it into us. We'll be fine. He has been denied a ton of CS because he's pushing it towards them. Because the problem is when you when he hits that first W on the wave, the rest of the waves are gonna like push towards him as well. It becomes a problem. I'm gonna deny my Targons too. And yeah, hit her. Don't hit the wave. That's what you want to do. Go. Want to use up my Targons here? Under turret should be a bit easier. Dodge that. Okay, once I hit double or get W at level three, we can potentially uh, flash fling under my turret as well. But for now, we do have to wait a bit and just chill. I think we go for uh, Lulu because she has no barrier. Unless Zeri gets poked out super hard, but we'll see. Okay, on my three. Yeah, just kill her. Easy money. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Let's push the wave in. I will help you, my friend. You gotta last hit, though. I'm not trying to steal CS or anything, but you gotta be the one to last hit these. Nice, there you go. Good job. Alright, let's get out of here. That'll push in, unless she tries to force freeze it, but whatever. Uh, I want to rush Symbiotic Souls here as well, if possible. I'm actually going to sell my potion and just wait for them, I think. Like I said, because we're going to be roaming a lot, these are most likely just the best boots to buy. If I can get them on five minutes, just about, a little bit before five minutes as support, that'll be crazy. Because then I can just unlock them and run across the map and help my team out. With a with, with a champion like Sin support, you you don't want to be locked in bot lane. You want you want to leave that bot lane. You can get kills and stuff, but you're pretty you're pretty flash reliant. I should talk about runes actually. Just standard Singe kill runes or lane, kill lane runes. <laughs> Area ignite scorch. You you could go ghost versus a melee support, I suppose, but versus a rain support, you want flash for the uh, what you just saw me do. Okay, I have targons here. I want to try and use it. Don't want to kill them. It's too quickly, time. but I do want to farm my support item, which is important. Nice. I'm 214 out of 400 here. I think Lulu is higher than me because she was harassing me. Yeah, she's 213, actually, so a little bit less than me. Yeah, we can probably push this way then. On my way. Before it freezes. Let me try to keep moving. She's higher than me, actually, yeah, because you're recalled or whatever. 
Nice. Okay, just keep moving, just keep moving, just keep moving. If they try and freeze, I can walk over here and double you the wave as well. Let's walk him in. We can help Perky. Oh no, if he kept moving, I maybe could have actually saved him there. But I guess he just wanted the, the wave over there. Okay. Potentially gank Vayne, but she's level 6 though. I can also go help Kha'Zix here. Or uh, help Nocturne, I mean. I'll go help Nocturne. <laughs> I don't think my brand really understands the waves. <laughs> because he's like non-stop pushing it into them, unfortunately, but whatever. The thing about waves isn't going to bounce back towards us, right? And I can just go back down and collect it, but that's okay. I'll use some Targons here in mid. Bonk. Bonk. Another nice part with Targons is you can just use it on other lanes as well as you move around the map. Enchanters also sometimes won't move. If they just want to, like, because they've been taught from birth to stay in their lane and spoon feed their ADC. So sometimes the concept of moving out of lane is kind of foreign to them. I just get her here. I do not just, in fact, get her there. I do, in fact, get her there. Or I get Zeri, I guess. The Lulu does live, sad. But I do get Zeri. She used both sums on me. She used flash and uh, exhaust there. That's okay. All right, so I think I'm gonna go for Trailblazer first. Actually, I could do Wormog support. Actually, I think that'd be fine too. I don't have um. Oh, I shouldn't actually, because yeah, I don't have the double. I don't have double health scaling shards. I took flat flat HP. You can't do Wormog unless you have double health scaling plus overgrowth on support. It's not possible. Although, I could just buy Warmogs and then buy HP and activate it. But I think for now I'll do the roaming setup with Trailblazer and Trillias and stuff like that. Ooh, we can kill her here if Kha'Zix comes. This is, this is, this is freebie. Uh, oh, she used her E. She used her E. We go, 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 go. We kill, we kill, we kill, we kill. Just absolutely dumb. I'm trying to steal this, actually. No, I'm not. You take it, bro. You take it, bro. All you. Did I proc my Targons there? Or no, I, I procced it by hitting her. You can you actually do activate it as well for dealing damage to any champs. Okay, I have my support item thing. I'm gonna try and Targons in mid if I can. Or we can just dive this guy as well. You can also get it for hitting turrets, I think. Yeah. Activates on turrets as well. Totally not a bait, by the way. Woo! I fell for it. I fell for it. <laughs> My bad. I knew it was a bait too, I even called it, but I'm just being stupid. I knew what it was and I walked right into it. Damn, damn, damn. Alright. Bye for Trailblazer. Trailblazer is just like a miniature Dead Man's Plate, where it's a little bit slower, a little bit less tanky than Dead Man's Plate, but you do get, um... Uh, you do get the movement speed that you gain goes to your allies as well, so pretty powerful. On a champion like Singe, where you're just moving. The support item upgrade, by the way, you can go Celestial Opposition, I think is fine. You can also go Solstice Stallion on Singe. Uh, technically, you totally could do Blood Song as well for burst damage. You could even do Zach Zach, like Zach Zach is probably a bit better on Singe for burst damage, but I think Blood Song activates on abilities anyway, so even if it's physical damage, it still works. It just has AD scaling, and you're not going to really buy AD, so... That can be potentially a little problematic. Let's see if we can stop these recalls. Nice. Look for rewards. There's a little pink ward here. Nice. There is no longer a pink ward there. Love to see it. I have a Targons here as well. I'm going to try and use on this cannon. It's actually the same gold value no matter what minion you execute. But the thing about taking cannons with Targons, even though you get the same gold value, is that the cannon dying faster means you push the wave faster because the cannon is like the tank of the wave, right? The tank dies sooner, you push wave sooner. I'm gonna come kill this ward. Should make Kassadin pretty upset. Why is the support always in my lane? The cry of a million solo laners. I'll just hold this wave for him.
Very nice. Help my Nocturne get grubs as well. I'll just go all over the map. Help my boys out. Kill this ward. Uh, nice thing about uh, having an AD carry like Brand as well is that they can have decent wave clear to kind of sort of 1v2 as well. Yoink. Give that 10 gold. Yeah, keep buying towards Trailblazer. I could buy a pink ward as well, but don't need to. I'm just leaving lane anyways, and Brand is just clearing 1v2, so it's like kind of a waste of gold. I could use, get a pink ward for top lane or something, but... Ooh, the one for one. Nice. Let's go see if I can gank top lane. Speaking of... If I can help him unfreeze this before Vayne kills him. Oh, I might have spoken too soon. Does he have W? Oh, nice W. You should have juke my fling. I don't know if you guys noticed that. Love to see it. Let's go. Shove this wave in for Yone so she can't freeze it. Very nice, very nice. Okay, I have Symbiotic Souls unlocked. I'm gonna get a turret plate here, actually. A little bit of gold. I think Brand can clear this if he has E. Either way, I get a turret plate. Maybe get two here, actually. Yeah, Castigen's walking up, but... Double turret played on the support singe. Oh boy. Unfortunate brand death, but... Something something wave management. I don't know. I'm getting so much value for the team that I think it's fine. Like, yeah, it sucks that he died, but the value is huge. The value is massive. And plus, they actually just both died, so... It works out. Trailblazer is up. This is going to be a lot of movement speed. This is 5% movement speed plus 20% uh, moving speed as well, so pretty decently fast. Not as fast as DMP, not as tanky, but look at me speeding up the quirky here. And then I just want to give him some Targons here. Uh, Targons, bro, chill. There you go. It's nearly time. Okay, I'm gonna gank top again, actually. I'm so fast. I'm 475 moves out of combat right now. That's like that's that's pretty ridiculous. Pink ward for my Yone here. Oh, she eat forward. We go for this now. Or she queued forward, I should say. That's okay. We can maybe just dive it straight up as well. At least force her out of lane. Nice. A lot of turret damage as well. I'll take the recall here. I'm gonna drop some words for him also. <laughs> Unlucky that you live, but it is what it is. Look we'll Shirley is next. Uh, yeah, as far as support item goes, Celestial Opposition or Solstice Slay, uh, I think for this game, I am solo frontline, so Celestial Opposition is really good. Honestly, Zack Zack sounds like fun, so fuck up, so Zack Zack. I want some damage, boys. I want to start killing. And Zack Zack is probably <laughs> just. It's. The flat damage is not much, but the cooldown is super low, 10 seconds, and is 3% max health damage, which is absolutely ridiculous for being on a just free item. So, quite nice, I'll take it. Plus, I'm going to get Shirelia, so this will actually scale a little bit with AP. Not not a ton, but it will a little bit. Come here, bonk. Look at that. Look at that damage. I'm going to hold this for Quirky as well. I got you, buddy. Come here. I got you. You eat all this. A generous support helps his entire team, right? Alright, I'm gonna... Ward over here. Oh, hello. On my way. I can speed the Nocturne going in here as well. Oh, shit, he's going for it. Let's go. I missed my W. That's my bad. But Quirky is on their mid tier too because I guess the Cassidy's just giving up on the lane. I'm not sure. He's not even like doing that badly. He's two and three, but the Quirky just is really far ahead of him. Oh, but you're grounded. You can't catch the Quirky. I guess you can kind of, but I'm here to defend him like a true support rat. Nice, we get Dragon as well. 
Yeah, I should play back. I need wards, but I want to get some XP here as well. The Lulu is out leveling by one level, but I think it's really important to just state how absolutely silly it is that I'm only half a level behind her. If that, I'm going to catch up soon too because of bounce back XP being absolutely atrociously overpowered. Then you can also go damage items on Singe Support if you want to. It's pretty silly. I have to flash this, unfortunately. The Zack Zack is doing work, though. Can I kill? There's a lot of HP. We take those. Oh, shit. Where'd that she went for me? Or went for Quirky and not me. I guess I want the shutdown though. Yeah. Alright, time to run. <laughs> Zack Zack, get me out. Trailblazer, get me out. <laughs> Look at this fucking vein, dude. Alright, no, 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 That's bad, that's bad. Sorry, bud. That's not a good fight. I'm out of here. See you, boys. That's looking a bit rough. Alright, buy AP now. For Shirelia's. You also grab a Rylize eventually if you want to. You can grab Leandries, you can grab Blackfire. There's a lot of options for support. Supports just get that juicy free gold income, so. Oh, that's a kill steal by me. Unintentional, but it has been done. I mean, you're fast, but I'm way faster, I think. Oh, she got the execute rip. Hate to see it. It's nearly time. It's my auto combat movement speed with the uh, Aether Wisp. Now I'm 489. Call it 490 movement speed out of combat. My god. Can we kill this guy, I think? Now he just turned into a kill support. He's running around the map, nuking everyone. This guy is low mana. I think I get him. He's he's basically um. Yeah, goodbye. No, it's mine. Yes, it's mine. <laughs> Give me that shit. Play Zack Zack damage 140. I think unfortunately I'm flinging them out of the the AOE spike because I'm gonna damage on the on that little AOE that pops up. Yeah, cause an explosion. So if you if you start your trade with fling, it actually throws them out of it. Unfortunately, that's not perfect, but oh well, it is what it is. I'm gonna GTFO. I need to heal anyways. Drop a ward. I have Shrelia's money. Even faster now. What other items give movement speed? Can I meme this? I guess I could do... No, Art and Sensor, because I'm not going to heal or shield my ally. Storm Surge, Cosmic, Lich Bane? Nah. I guess I could just go war mogs now. An ally has been slain. Can you just grab a mogs? An enemy has been my, slain. um... Trailblazer is 200. My rune is 65. So I would need 15 more HP. <laughs> Can I save you, Bran? I think I can save you. I'm here. I'm gonna speed you out. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. If he if he runs on the trailblazer, he gets movement speed, so he's he's faster there. Then he turns around and he's slower. That's a lot of movement speed that he gets actually from 385 to 450 is insane. I know. I knew trailblazer was good, but my god, that's a lot. Nice turret. I can get ahead of him here and just speed him up more. Pretty wild. Oh shit, ward. Nice. Let me kill. Yeah, this Lulu has one item plus support item. I have two items, so I'm a flight ahead of her. Generating a lead like this on support is kind of nuts. I'm just going to stay in the area, try and leech some XP. Standing here in case they try decide to dive my brand, but I think he's fine. Just depends on what he wants to do. If he wants to prep for Baron, I can prep for Baron as well. I kind of want to get a little bit more gold, though. I want to get, um... Moonplate. I'll poison one minion here and just try and steal it. Nice, it's all none of them. Let's go. Huge. All I did was mess up the wave. You unable to farm it? You're good, bro. Get that shit. I'm trying to run mid. 
489 moves to be out of combat. God, that is so crazy. Hey, I can go help Corky as well. I can just kind of be everywhere. I'm so fast. My items are very balanced. Your team has destroyed a turret. I'm on the way, bud. Run. Zack Zack! Smacker! She might die here, actually. <laughs> no way! She's fucking cooked, dude. Oh, that's not great, though. Time to leave. Time to leave. Alright. More moving speed. What am I now? Oh god, Nocturne Run. I am now 513 move speed out of combat. Good lord. I could get Landry's eventually. Play Zack Zack damage. Okay, I definitely have done more than 140 damage. That number seems inaccurate because I did a lot of damage to the Zeri just right there in that little scenario. It was 140 before. That's okay, though. I'll grab this for the team. Why does Support Singe kill the crab faster than Solo Lane Singe? That seems a little wrong. Runs to the wave, he removes the ISO. But I'm here so quickly. Need to help my brand. The quirky is doing quirky things. Need a clear vision in here. I need to drop wards as well whenever I have the chance. It's nearly time. Help my Yoni out. Yeah, like I said, I'm caught up in level to Lulu now. I'm actually going to be ahead of her in level soon, I think. Kind of nuts. From just running around and being a demon and helping my team. I think Gork is getting ganked and run up there. Should be here pretty quick. We can Baron us all at some point if we need to. I have 13 move speed, this is insane. Because we do have, have a cloud buff, but, like, come on, man, that is actually wild. <laughs> For items that are this cheap as well, it just seems kind of crazy. I'll tank it up for you, boys. Very nice. Build towards mogs. That'll be a lot of movies that I combat as well. Although I will have to buy another Ruby Crystal, I think, to fully activate it, because I technically will only have... Actually, no, 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 sorry, my bad. Zack Zack gives... Oh, wait, I forgot, I'm stupid. The support items all give HP. They all give 200 HP, don't they? So you can just activate it with, like, one health scaling shard when you get a Warmog's Rush of support. You don't even need... You don't even need the other items. Wait, that's crazy. I never thought about that. Because they just get a free 200 health item. No gold cost. Wait, that is actually kind of bonkers. That is, that is something, right? But now I can just run around, perma speed my boys up. If we're worried about Quirky, just perma speed him. I'm gonna go over here and help him actually. Yoink! Oh, I wanted to steal it, Rip. I can potentially flash fling Zeri. <laughs> nice. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. Away from the wall. Away from the wall. No! He flashed on me, bro! <laughs> Come on.
come on. All right, I got my mogs though soon. That's that makes me happy at least. <laughs> the vein was spacing really well, and I had to I had to flash to fling it, but then Kazakh flashed on me. Unlucky, man, unlucky. That's all good. They might get that uh that dragon. Unfortunately, that was our soul point. But that's okay. I got mogs, and I'll be even faster out of combat. That gets finished off like a Landry's last or a uh, Blackfire last, so. Either or. Yeah, I feel like the Zack Zack has done way more than 211 damage. That seems not accurate. But that's okay. Mog is up. Alright, out of combat speed now will be very high with this as well. It is fully activated because my items are stupid. And for some reason, the support items all give 200 HP for free. Like, I feel like the damage support items should not give HP for free, right? Like, I think even Dream Maker gives it, yeah. But now I am 538 move speed out of combat. <laughs> My god. Plus, I, I, I heal now as well after I get poked. It's just like... Come on, dude. Come on. My support item gives health regen also. Or, sorry, mana regen. So I never have to worry about mana either. I was trying to give that one to you, but sure. Yeah, I just run around with permanent 8 mana per second because of this fucking item. Wild. Oh, bad W. My fault, my fault. I'm kind of taxing this guy a bit here. Gotta stop. I'm being a bit of a demon. Okay, I'm gonna walk up. They see me, though. I did live, but I could not get to this area. They peeled her so hard, they're gonna have mogs coming up. Just heal, 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 heal. I can keep going here. Got some vision for the boys. Health bar is health bar is coming up. Here's, here's Vayne. Gotta be careful here. Dude, I can make the quirky so fast, by the way, when he runs on my on my trailblazer. I give him like 75 movement speed. He's no more than that actually. He was 535 there. Okay, let's go the other way, actually. I don't like this. I'm a little nervous, boys. All I'm doing is just spreading my trailblazer here, killing this guy. Nice. Then the whole enemy team is just dead. Let's fucking go. His area's alive, but I think it's fine. Bye-bye. Yeah, I like Zack Zack did way more than 358 damage there. Dude, I forgot that the surprise items give health. Victory. So you only need one health scaling shard to activate Wormlog's first item. That is absolutely wild, bro. So was that was that 538 moves speed out of combat, I think? On the uh on the Perma Rome support strat. The river shinged. It was quite a bit. Alright, let's see. Uh I had, I don't even know, how, how do you tell how well the support did? I don't know. I shit on them is all I know. I, I did a lot that game. I helped all three of my lanes. I helped my jungler. I got a couple kills even. It was just, just kind of kind of a banger. That being said, boys, I want to see how much my out of combat speed was. So I, I, so I backed for mogs here. It was 538, right? Yeah, it was 530 out of combat speed. If we had that, that last uh, cloud buff, it would have been even more, actually, which is just wild. But... Quite a bit of speed. Yeah, I feel like the Zack Zack did way more than what it says. Because even just right there, that would have been a ton of damage that it just, like, it doesn't show. Because 3% of the Katzen's max health plus the flat, like, 30 or whatever damage is doing is, is not bad at all. But that being said, guys, thank you for watching. I do appreciate it. Catch the next one. Later, everyone. Peace, boys.